Yeah, I'd say when I was younger in my career, I, I made a lot of mistakes. I still make a lot of mistakes. When I was a lot younger, however, it felt like those mistakes were devastating. And I worked a lot with CRM systems, and consumer files. There's a lot with data and kind of slicing and dicing. And I can think of like one example in particular where I sent the wrong communication to the wrong group um, of consumers. I switched them up and I realized the mistake and thought, oh my God, I'm going to get in so much trouble. I failed my job. I might get fired. And what ended up happening, I talked to my boss. We talked about, you know, why it happened. It was an honest mistake. We ended up sending an apology email and the outcome was actually, we had a lift in our engagement rate. And I think the consumers almost appreciated and understood that we had this moment of like humanity within our marketing where like somebody made a mistake and there's a human on the other side of that, you know, marketing machine and engagement lifted from that. So it was a great story with a a positive outcome. But now I, especially in the startup world, everything is new and everything is something we're doing kind of for the first time. So rather than looking at uh, a situation as kind of a win or lose, you know, I approach it with more curiosity and say like, what am I going to learn from this? Something's going to work and something's not going to work and just refining it from there. So it's actually something that at ShopTrue, we've built into kind of our culture code that it's really all about learning and there's no failure as long as you pull a lesson from it and we can do better or do different next time. So it's really about the mindset and the approach that you take. Failure is inevitable. It's just what you do with it. 